Bell. Hi, YouTube. Did I scare you? Of course I did, because I'm so good at everything. Anyway, I'm a Val, but of course you already knew that. But anyway, so today, guys, I've got a really good video for you, because today I realized something very important is coming up. And no, don't worry about my birthday. That is still 12 months off. But you still have time to get me presents. <laughs> but anyway, um, today I realized that Halloween, the holiday that is like made for me, is coming up. Because you dress up, you knock on people's doors and demand candy from them. And, and then you get like really hyped on sugar. And you don't even remember what you did the night before. So yeah, this is totally my holiday, but I realize lots of people suck at Halloween, so I'm gonna help you guys get ready for it. <laughs> Snaps! But yeah, so first off, the first thing you need to do is to go to the store. And I know what you're thinking, Val, why don't I ever go to a store? I do all my shopping online. Well, you see... Sometimes it's easier to order candy from, to get it from the store than to order it online. So it's best to try to actually go to the store. I know this is some major inconvenience, but it's what needs to be done, girl. It's what needs to be done. All right. So to give you an example of what you should do, I took some video of what I did when I went to the store. So here's that. Play the video. So it can get really boring in the car, so let's play a game. I play I Spy. I spy with my little eye something that's tall with a light in it. Alright, so here we are finally at the store that's like five minutes away. Terrible. I'm looking at the candy, and it's all really expensive. Look at this. You get two fun size bag of M&M's for $6. Really? And I'm looking at the other stuff. And as I'm looking, I notice that somebody TP'd the place. Rude! And now I'm looking at some of the other stuff, and what's really funny is that they were selling Miley Cyrus stuff. Yeah, the skeletons. For $3.44. Like, Miley, you're worth more than that. You're worth at least $4.44. And now we're done with shopping. Now that you have candy, which you will need to, like, load up on sugar, now that you have the candy, what you need to do is you need to pick out what you're going to wear. Now, this is the one time in your life where you can be something that's not as dumb and boring as you are. It's one of the only times where you get to dress up as something besides your horrible self. So, uh, I decided that I would dress up this year, because normally I just go as myself, but I decided I would actually dress up this year to make myself more like you commoners. So, I'm going to change clothes in a three, two, one. Alright, so, now I'm in a costume. Now you know what you're wondering. Val, what on earth could you be? Well, the answer is, I am dressed up like a cheerleader from Taylor Swift's so Shake It Off video who's wearing mouse ears that's dressed up like Kim Kardashian with a flat booty that like gets drawn like one of Jack's French girls. Oh, and also, I'm American. <laughs> Oh, by the way, if you didn't get that, your IQ is obviously like a 10. Yeah. So, this is an amazing costume, and I know that you probably can't get something as good as this, mostly because it's copyrighted. But if your costume isn't as good as mine, here's some public domain costume ideas that you could use. Oh, by the way, if you do use them, you owe me 20 bucks. Just saying. Now, this one's not so bad. I think it's actually really good, because I call it my future boyfriend. Great costume. Now, this one is what I call my brother thinks that he's a great sports star just because he got a scholarship to play baseball. Now, this is what I call um, thinking that Clue is still a game. That's so 2015. But this one's my all-time favorite classic one. It's called Black. End of story. So, uh, there you go. 
Now you're all ready for Halloween. Now here's the last step. Drag one of your friends who really doesn't want to hang out with you and make them watch all of the Halloween specials with you. And I'm talking every Halloween special there ever was. Like Charlie Brown and the Great Pumpkin. And that's it. Last thing to do is this step. Uh, now? Yeah? Um, are those kids outside? Yeah, probably. I would think that they realize that a porch light on means that this house doesn't have candy. But obviously, their good-for-nothing parents never taught them anything. I mean, seriously, I'm surprised at their determination, though. I really thought after I dumped that trash can full of ice water on them, they would have left. Especially after the trash can fell out the window, too. Oh well. Those brats won't learn. I guess I better go get the hose. So there you go. That's how to survive Halloween. You're welcome and have a good Halloween. Though mine's gonna be better, whatever yours is. So, just saying. Anyways, see you later, guys. Bye! Bye, YouTube. Bell! Thanks for watching the video, guys. You rock! Oh, and remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more cool videos. Oh, and happy Halloween. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, that hurt my throat. See you later. Bye.